Hey, this is Ty from Oasis Auto. Today, I want to show you how to install our universal seat cover. Once you receive the package, inside the package, you will have a installation instruction, a written one for both front and back. You will also receive one bag of hardware. It's either black or tan. It depends on the color of the seat cover that you have. To install the seat covers, what we want to do is we want to first put in our front seat cover. This is what it looks like if you take it out from the package. What you want to do is you want to make sure that you disconnect this elastic band in the middle. And then once you fold it up, you will realize that there is two elastic bands right in between the bottom and your baggers, right over here. And there is two in the front. For the two front one, you want to apply one of these hook to each of these elastic band. And then for the middle one, right over there in between the separation, you want to apply the circular clips. The way to do it for the circular clip is to insert it from the, from the brakes on top and then at the bottom. This is what it looks like. You want to install one clip on each of these elastic band. And for top, over here, you want to install one of these metal hook. The way to do it is to insert this elastic band through the hole, pull it out, open the top, and have this metal hook go through the top again. Once you apply the metal hooks and the round clips at the middle, this is what it looks like. And then you wanna make sure that you disconnect this apron band. Before you tuck in the front seat cover, make sure you have the zipper open all the way. You want to open it all the way so it does not break the zipper while you tuck in the front seat cover. Once you tuck in the seat cover, this is what it's supposed to look like. Once you tuck in the front seat covers, what you want to do is you want to insert these round clips right in between your bottom cushions and your back wrist. The way to do it is, is pushing in there and while you're pushing, you're just pushing like this, apply force right over here. And then once you push in there, it will automatically tilt. What's happening is that you're pushing it down here in front. And once it reaches the back, this clip will tilt and it will hold on the back like this. You want to push it through until you reach the back and you want to tilt it. So this clip would hold on the back and it would stop the seat cover moving forward. The next step would be applying this metal hook onto something underneath your seat. Now what we want to do is connect these aprons on the back of your seat. What you want to do is you want to pull this out and go through the back and connect at the bottom of your seat. Basically, you just want to connect this clip. Last part would be put our headrest down. What you want to do is you want to first raise your headrest slightly so there's a gap. You want to pull these two elastic band and then fold this and connect the elastic band on the back. Now you want to lower your headrest once you lower it and then you want to close the zipper. And when you do this, just do it with a little bit of extra care. Just make sure that you don't just trying to apply too much force on the zipper, otherwise it might break. Just pull it together when you're closing it and it will close eventually. Once you close this side, you do the same thing on the other side. For the rear seat, you want to install the bottom cushion first. Depend on the vehicle, there are two styles. Style one have no gap between the bottom cushion and the floor. And style two does have a gap as shown in the picture we are watching right now. Please do watch both style. This way it ensure you to install it properly. We'll start with style one and then I will show you style two. For the best fit, we highly recommend you to remove your bottom cushion. In order to do that, you gotta pull it out. If you're not sure how to do it for your car, you can just YouTube it and find the way to do it for your own model. Once we take out the bottom cushion, you want to apply the three pieces just like we did without taking out the bottom cushion. The only thing is that you're gonna connect all these bottom cushions at the back. The way to do it is to apply a circular clips on one of the elastic band and then connect the second one over here and then connect the long one. For all these clips, you can leave it hanging and then just put the bottom cushion right back on your car or you can pull them out, put the bottom cushion on and reinsert them. If you choose to install our seat cover without removing the bottom cushion, you can follow this instruction. Basically, apply the circular plastic clip at location one, two, three, four, five, short on the top left hand side of this picture. Now you want to insert these circular clips in between the backrest and bottom cushion, just like we did for the front seat. For step two and step three, you want to insert 
the black plastic clip right in between your bottom cushion and the floor of your car. You can find it at location 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 on the top left hand side picture. If your vehicle is a second scenario which there is a space between the bottom cushion and the car, what you want to do is you want to pull this long elastic band out and reach underneath the seat and pull it out on the back and then connect this long elastic band with this two short one with the circular clip. The way to do it is push it through over here and sometimes you might need somebody else to help you to reach from the back, pull these out and connect all three this all three of these elastic bands with the circular clip and then push it back. It's possible, depends on the car, that you want to apply the circular clips over here first and push it down and then try to connect at the bottom of the seat with this long elastic band at the bottom of your seat. It depends on the car. However, on the backrest, you want to put them on there and then connect the clips on the back for the headrest and then at the bottom there will be two elastic bands you want to apply for the round clips just like we did for the front and for the bottom and then insert this round clips in between backrest and bottom cushion push it in tilt it so it would stay in place 